Hi, my name is Cynthia, and I cannot write poetry, not even a line, but I wish I could. <laughs> and so I started Duke's computational poetry team, where we have an algorithm try to write poems. And when we started, I thought this problem was solved. I thought you just throw a bunch of poems into a neural network and it just produces poems that are good. But the truth is that that's not what happens. Um, so if you actually ask uh, GPT-2 to, GPT-2 is a leading algorithm for text generation. If you tell it to write a poem, it produces something like this. Thank you and you all have a great day of, luck back in a place of your own and you, make up for lost hearts even with what you, in past so kills, look like you did all right. Thanks guys, bet, ugh, this was good work and think, and it keeps going on like that, just sort of, sort of conversational junk. Um, but in our poetry team, we've been doing something very different and uh, it's not because we've made a bigger and better neural network, it's because we hired English majors and we have people who actually care about poetry. We actually embedded our knowledge of how poems should look um, into these algorithms. It was a lot of manual work. It's not just throwing things into a giant neural network. Um, so I'm gonna read you a poem that our algorithm wrote um, the poem is called, um, I call it the maker because it feels like it's an entity that's sort of making the world. Um, as, as you sort of read the poem, you sort of uncover more, uh, more of that. Uh, I changed only three words to make it sound more poetic. Uh, I changed red to blue, bark to hark, and berry to merry. Okay, so without further ado, the maker. The blue sea slanted you to serenade. Within your long hall, you forgo the sun. For the beauty the company forbade, where all the grasses of your past lives spun. Within your wooded vale, you see the way of your light to be meander waterfalls, and inching a ravine where branches sway, whose wistful edge it oftentimes recalls. Where all the plants of your glad flowers fade, forbidding a desert where clouds adore, you walk the earth of your endearing shade hit back the breathless merry of your shore. Within your brown stone, you make the lagoon, hark back the wayward banner of your moon. And that's it. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope it inspired you. Thanks.